Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Shanna Ross and I am the owner of From Dreams to Designs. And today I am going to show you how to do a watermark over an image using Canva. So I am on the desktop version of Canva and I do use Canva Pro. So the elements that I'm going to use are all accessible to me, included in my subscription. Um, if you don't have Canva Pro, there are some free elements. If you run into where you're not, you don't have enough elements, you would either pay per element or you can upgrade to Pro and you can access all of them. So to start, I am going to go over here to elements. So you see, I already have my design prepped, my background and my design in place. And to add my watermark, I want a crisscross shape. So that I searched this already. So this is what you can search for, or you can pick another search item or term rather to find what you're looking for. But just for this, this is the one that I use. I'm going to turn this to a 45 degree angle just because I like the way that it looks diagonally as opposed to the straight up and down. And I'm just making this big enough to cover my design. I'm not worried about it covering the background. I just want to make sure that it covers my design well enough. And I'm going to change the color, so I'm going to change it to a lighter color. You can do gray or white. And then to make this even lighter, I'm going to change the transparency. So I'm going here, and I'm going to change it to 50%. And you can play around with it, whatever you like. I like 50% because it's still there and would still prevent somebody from just grabbing my design and tracing it or stealing my picture, yet it's not too much in the way of my actual design. And then when you're done with everything, you can go ahead and just download it. This one's already sized for my Etsy, so 2000 by 2000, it's already there. I'm going to need a PNG and it downloads there. So very simple and you can take it from your downloads and do whatever you want to do, whatever you need to do with it. So that is how I add a watermark to my photos using Canva. Hopefully this was helpful for you and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. And I will see you later. Bye.